All right, everybody, welcome back to another part of this Fallout 4 walkthrough. So last time we finished off with the Vault Tech DLC, we finally got rid of uh, Overseer Barstow. Finally, took forever. Just a horrible person. And I made that, I still regret that. I still think about that mistake of actually setting that last, uh, that last experiment to actually harmful for Clem. I feel bad about that. But we got through that and I cleared out the place. I didn't build anymore because I want to follow an actual design off of YouTube. Because there's so many things you can do. And it's just kind of, well, unlimited options. But I don't want to uh, get too time, uh, time soaked into that settlement when I don't really care about it all that much. So today we're actually going to start with the Far Harbor DLC. I believe it's, yeah, this quest, Far From Home. Listen to the, listen to Valentine's Detective Agency Radio. This is Ellie Perkins from Valentine's Detective Agency with a message for Nick's partner. We've got a new case and it sounds urgent. Stop by the office. I'll be waiting. Setting this to repeat. Okay. Oh, turn it off. This is Ellie. So that is Diamond City Market. fast travel there I wish I almost wish Valentine's detective agency had its own fast travel location in Diamond City because I feel like I go that there explosion came from the old CIT ruins Maybe, if you believe the stories or the Mayor history McDonough, could the I Institute really have been destroyed Institute since Piper was right he's one of them McDonough is a synth Oh, God. What do we do now? You can stop standing around. Someone get a doctor. McDonough's a synth. Someone Solomon. has to do something. Two slugs in the gut. Can I give him a gift stim pack? Take this stim pack. Thank you. The mayor. He's part of the Institute? Oh, God. Okay, well, I'll come back to that at some point. You, you it's just gonna be a fight against uh, Stop by the mega surgery. Yeah, it's just gonna be a fight against Mayor McDonald, so it don't matter too much. Don't walk outside the wall undefended. High quality protect Here we go. For Valentine Detective Agency. I'm glad you're here. We got a new case while you and Nick were out. Ready to put on the detective hat? Let's hear it. Tell me more. Our client is a fisherman who lives on the edge of the Commonwealth, Kenji Nakano. Nakano? Huh. That name takes me back. Hmm. My memory's a little fuzzy on the details, though. Maybe if you bothered writing things down, Nick. Can't do that. Wouldn't want to put you out of a job. Huh. I'll remember that the next time you need me to console a hysterical client. Mr. Nakano didn't leave many details. Said he'd go over everything when you meet him. But if you want my guess, Missing person case. Guy had a worried look a mile long. Anything you can tell me about Kenji Nakano? Just some impressions. He was obviously upset, but he was also in a hurry. Like, he couldn't stand just waiting around. I'm a friend of Nick's. He'll remember me. I need his help right away. And then he was gone. He was muttering something on the way out, but... No. I'm not sure it was important. Come on, Ellie. Don't hold out on me. What did he say? Well, I thought I heard him say something about a daughter and also a radio, but I might have misheard him. Not sure how the two would be connected. I'll go check it out. Thanks, Ellie. The Nakano residence is up in the northeast, near the coast. A small fishing house. He said that he and his wife will be waiting for you. It's a long walk. <laughs> That's how the hard cases always start. I think I'm actually going to take Nick with me Nick, on this DLC. Time to hit the road. Yeah. Let's head out. Well, all right. Sorry, dog meat. You've been awesome, but it's all right, boy. I'll take it from here. See, I feel like he's the only uh, companion that'll console dog meat. Sorry, dog meat. Going back to sanctuary. Okay. Hey, let me ask you something. Sure. Ask away. It's just, uh, with everything that's happened with you and your, your family, it's a whole hell of a lot to process. Uh, I wanted to make sure you're holding up all right. 
Yeah, I'm all right. Huh. You're a tougher nut than I thought. Tougher than I was. Took me a long damn time to get a feel for this place. Thank goodness I found Diamond City. It's got its flaws, sure, but it beats the hell out of anywhere else in the Commonwealth. Of course, when I took up there back when, people were just as scared of the Institute as they are now. Oh, Maybe they're more. gone now, so... The massacre of the CPG was still pretty fresh in people's minds at that point. And folks were still losing sleep over the broken mask. Plenty of people assumed I was just a saboteur, moving in to melt down the reactor or poison the drinking water. But at the time, they couldn't exactly turn me away. Why would you want to live among bigots like that? Nah, I couldn't really blame them, given the circumstances. But folks sure started turning the other cheek when I showed up with the mayor's daughter. Gal of about 15. Pride and joy of the mayor back then. Man by the name of Henry Roberts. The young Miss Roberts decided she'd run off with some caravan hand she'd, uh, <clears throat> known for an evening. Turns out the guy was part of a gang of kidnappers. I didn't even know who I was rescuing, just stumbled on a crying girl and four toughs. I took her home and the mayor dubbed me a hero, offered me a place in town. Lots of folks protested and said I was a spy, but he wouldn't have it. Taking up in the city was tricky at first, but I never tried to hide what I was, and people seemed to warm to that. Was it hard settling in? Yeah, they sure didn't make it easy. I started off doing the jobs no one else wanted. I got more banged up being Diamond City's handyman than I ever did living out in the ruins. But I guess folks never forgot I rescued the mayor's daughter, so they started coming to me when people went missing. Wife runs off with a new paramour and takes the rent money with her? Talk to the synth. An upset father decides moving him and the kids to good neighbor in the dead of night's not the worst damn idea since the bomb? Go get Nick. After a while, the jobs got so backed up, they didn't even ask me to do the handyman stuff anymore. Hell, I was so happy to do it, it was months before I started charging anyone. I never stopped being Nick the synth. But it was Nick the detective folks came to see. It was about then that things, uh, well, things finally started feeling normal. It took me a long time to realize that home is where you make it. And with some time and effort, this place can be home for you, too. That's a long story, but I hope it helps. Want to get moving? Be careful when you head over to the Nakano residence. That whole area is pretty isolated. I think we can handle it. You'd think I'd learned my lesson by now about making sure I save. But with all the Vault 88 stuff and... Dying and losing progress and Automatron. And I, it seems I'm not learning my lesson that I need to make saves. So that I don't lose 30 minutes to an hour of progress. But it's been tough. So I do got another perk level. I did science four last time, finally, so I could get that, uh, that vault, uh, the fusion reactor. I put one in sanctuary. What else do I want, though? Armor is maxed. Could do blacksmith, but that doesn't matter to me. I think I'll go gun nut. Get the final ranks in those. I can level up any anything else I need. Oh, it is pretty far up there. I'll go to Museum of Witchcraft. Oh, I heard about that from somebody in Diamond City here. Dunwich Boars. That's where I'll go to. I was trying to remember which place is not heavily infested with enemies. Okay, it's not them. Well, we can head up this way, though. I think, technically, uh, these places aren't cleared out. Wait, don't know which borders should be. I don't know why it doesn't say cleared.
Museum of Witchcraft. I... I don't remember what that is. Holy crap, my alert queen. That's probably the museum. Somebody's popping off shots over here. Might have been Nick walking, actually, now that I think about it. Okay, we were totes gonna fight that uh, My Alert Queen real quick. Come on, Nick. Get ready. Dog meat's always been useless in these fights, so. Actually, dodge these. Swap over to Overseer's Guardian. Oh yeah, that does quite a bit of damage. Oh god. What the heck's a kill claw? I don't know what the heck a kill claw is, but I feel like that was almost tougher than the Meyerly Queen. So the Nakano residence is over there. I just want to discover some locations close by. Holy crap. I'm not going in there. It's a dark cave. You joking? pretty far out there, isn't it? <sighs> I thought I was pretty close. Oh, it's way up here. Oh yeah, speaking of ghouls, some of that apparel I got from the legendary gear, I realized that I've been using the base combat armor forever, and I've definitely gotten some, some of the uh, legendary combat armor, and I've never equipped any of them. So I finally upgraded some of them. I got like this plus three to all stats when you are at 25% or less health. Hopefully I'm never that low, but if I am, sure. Plus two luck, and then... Grants increasing energy and damage resistance the lower your health, up to plus 35. I figured that was pretty good. And I got the Legend of Vault 88 all the way up to Shielded, because I got Science 4 once again. So it just helps out with the, uh, well, with just keeping me alive, honestly. Oh, come on. One way there we go. Cool You're a glowing one. Why are you out there? What's that? If you're not going to come off the barge, I'm not going to come to you, so. You can stay up there. It's all good. Where is the Nakano residence? <sighs> oh. 
Nick, are you fighting that glowing one? Oh, this is definitely the path to it. They're pretty far out here. Oh, is that it? Oh, this is it. Oh, nice. Got a nice house over here. A lot of fishing gear. They got a working boat? What the heck? Damn it! Come in! I know you're listening on the other end. Where is she? Where is my daughter? Kenji, please. You've been at this for hours. Stop. You need sleep. She's out there, Ray. So Someone has her. They could be raiders, or gunners, or God knows. I uh, hope you don't mind. We let ourselves in. Nick, thank God. You need to get to work right away. She could be hurt. She could be... Whoa, whoa, slow down. Uh, Kenji, was it? Why did you go over the details with me and my partner here? You have to get to work right away, Detective. So, what's the story with you and Nick? Nick didn't tell you? Ran with him on one of his cases a few years back, searching for some sort of lost heirloom. He needed a boat. Things didn't end well. We were double-crossed by the client once we had what he was looking for. I still have some lead lodged into my hip. Ah, uh, right. Yeah, it's starting to come back to me. Sorry things ended sour. We got out. That's all that mattered. And now you can return the favor by finding my daughter. We're here to help. Tell us what happened. It's all thanks to this damn radio. Our daughter Kasumi likes to fix things. The radio was her latest project. Until she made contact with some kidnapper who lured her away from us. Or maybe she left on her own. She's not a child anymore. Our daughter is 19. She knows how to survive and she's capable. I... think maybe she left because she wanted her own life. No. She would have told us where she was going. She would have said something. I know my daughter is in danger. I can feel it. Find her, please. Do you have any idea where she could have gone? We know she took one of the boats, but that's all. She could be anywhere. Uh, I don't even think I'm going to ask for money. I feel bad for this. We'll find, we'll find her. her. Don't you worry. Thank you. Her room is upstairs if that helps. And if you had any more questions about her, just ask. Don't worry, Kenji. We'll get to the bottom of this. Just sit tight. Optional. Question them further. Mr. Nakano. Did you have questions? About my daughter? Anything more you can tell me about Kasumi? The smallest detail could be important. I don't know what more to say. She's my little girl, and she doesn't know how dangerous this world is. I never should have let her grandfather teach her how to fix these machines. Her grandfather? He taught her how to fix the radio? Ever since she was old enough to walk, yes. Her grandfather had an ear for machines. Kasumi picked up the knack. He passed away recently. He used to scavenge the ruins in the... Tell me more about this radio she was fixing. I've tried to get that damn thing to work over and over again. But there's nothing. I thought she just wanted to strip it for parts, or build a toaster out of it, or something, like she usually does. Someone made contact with her, and then- Uh-huh. Why did your daughter really leave? You... I know it was kidnappers. Kasumi is a smart girl. Why would she just leave her family uh -huh. every minute we aren't looking? No more questions right now. Work quickly, detective. Okay. I did investigate Mrs. this Nikana. radio. I suppose you have questions about my daughter. I'd like to know more about my daughter. I think she's going to say the same things. Every detail is important, Mrs. Nakano. Don't hold back. It's just that we mm -hmm. he was the only one that could she started staying. Tell me more about this radio your daughter was working on. I remember. We're pretty I You and your husband. <sighs> but Kenji, uh -huh. maybe because it's more frightening. Nothing else right now. Nothing but static. Figures whoever Kasumi was talking to wouldn't be taking calls once she took off. Maybe there's something else that can help us.
looks like this is Kasumi's room. Let's see if she left any clues about where she went. Go ahead and play these. Project log, dreams. I'm recording what I can remember when I wake up. I keep having the same one. I'm in a white room. People are talking about me like I'm not there, or maybe they just don't care. And then there's this, I don't know, jolt, like a spark of electricity to the back of my head, and then everyone turns to look at me. God, I hope I don't have it again tonight. Oh, I was hoping it was a workshop. It'd be nice to have this as a settlement. Okay, the boathouse. Boathouse safe key. That was lucky. Loot, loot them for all the money they have, apparently. <laughs> about who or what I am, but God, where do I start? The radio. I was right about the range. I managed to get a signal, a strong signal from up north. There's a group of people up there. They say they're all synth, synthetic people, made by the Institute. They're trying to build a place for their kind, where they can be themselves and be accepted for Let's take what a they are to that alongside holiday. human beings. That's what I'm doing, Nick. It sounds wonderful, but then they started asking about me, and some questions came up. Questions I don't have answers to. I mean, I've always felt off, like I'm not really supposed to be here, but then there are things in my childhood I can't remember, and I've been having strange dreams. I... I'm going to go to meet these synths. I I have to know the truth about myself. They've told me to sail up north to a town called Far Harbor. I can make my way to them from there. So the daughter takes off by boat. But more importantly, there's a colony of synths up near this Far Harbor. We need a way to get there. Let's go talk to Kenji. He knows the waters better than anyone. So, so Kasumi thinks she's a synth, is what's going on. Oh, so it's a hint of the key. They get locked out of the safe, and the answer is here in the boathouse. Picture where the key is. Got it. So, the daughter thinks she's a synth, because she's had strange dreams. I don't know, she might be a synth, but... I feel like I doubt it. They usually try to put synths in, like... Pretty key locations. Some random girl out here in the middle of nowhere. I don't know if they'd have a synth replace have her. Have you finished your investigation? Did you find anything? I need to ask you an important question. Are you sure your daughter is human? What kind of question is that? Why are you asking? Your daughter made contact with a group of synths. She thinks she's one of them. What? That's... that's crazy. She's not a synth. She's our daughter. We raised her. I... I gave birth to her. She's flesh and blood, not a synthetic. 
Maybe your daughter is just confused. Uh, having an identity crisis. Oh, God. Does she even think we're still her parents? This is what I was afraid of. Did you find where Kasumi went, Detective? Yep. I think I know where Kasumi went. A place called Far Harbor. She went that far up north? God, that explains why she took the boat. You have to go after her. Please, take my other ship on the dock outside. My father's design. It has a guidance system, and it is built for distance. What can I expect out there, Kenji? I only made the trip to Far Harbor once, when I was a boy. All I remember is that my father did not want to stay long. Something about the air being bad. I'll get to the bottom of this, Kenji. Thank you. I know you haven't asked for a payment, and we can't offer much. But here, please take it. I insist. For expenses, if nothing else. I know it'll be hard waiting for word, but try to carry on like normal. We'll be back as soon as we can. Fine, Kasumi. Please. I am not telling the Brotherhood about the Synth Refuge. Are you joking? How is that even an option? I mean, I guess if you're going to full-on Brotherhood playthrough. But that's just stupid. It's not even part of this quest. Okay, it's just a miscellaneous. What's a kitty cat? Okay. Well, guess we're going up to Far Harbor. You ready, Nick? Hey. I and the people of the Commonwealth slept soundly. But the greatest monster was gone. It took a lot of guts to do what you did. I know it couldn't have been easy. It had to be done. You'll get no argument from me. It's hard to even wrap your head around. A world without they the had been around for lurking two centuries. in the shadows. But that's the life the people of the... Sure. I didn't do it alone. Sure, sure. But we both know without you, this yeah. is a brave... That's all right. Let's make a save here. Boat controls activate. Travel to Far Harbor. So it can drive by itself? That's pretty sick. Sorry, kitty cat. I wish I could take you with me. Where's Nick at? Nick, am I leaving you here? Okay, I guess I'm going by myself. It's gonna be a long boat ride. We're going up to Maine, right? Far Harbor is Maine. I believe. I mean, we're in Boston, so... It's not, like, down south to up north, but still, it's a pretty far boat ride. Holy crap. Oh, I can see what he means by the air being bad. Probably got hit pretty hard by, uh, radiation. Oh, there's a little town here. Okay. Got some defenses built up. Could this be a settlement? Put the damn gun down. Complete far from home. Okay. Oh, there's Nick. Just teleport in. Are you lost? This is Far Harbor. We, we don't get many visitors around here. Do your here. business and get gone. We don't need no freeloaders or more help, Mainlander. So you can get back in your boat and leave. Alan, this isn't your dock. It belongs to the whole town. And that means strangers are welcome. Uh, sorry, you've caught us during a, a difficult time. Uh, but Alan's got a point. Not all visitors have good intentions. So, uh, what's your business here? A young woman from the Commonwealth named Kasumi may have passed through here. Her family hired me to find her. Some sort of detective, huh? Well, she came through here all right. At least we know she made it this far. Damn it. Mariners ain't coming. Something's coming through the fog! You, help us defend the town. Take a post at the top of the wall near the main gate. 
The hall never lets us down. Now follow me. Be careful okay. of the hall, stranger. Don't fall off. If you do, oh, we'll might follow not be her. able to rescue okay. you in time. Let's make another save before we get into combat here. Let me pull out, uh... I don't want to use that. Let's go over to his guardian. I have a lot of ammo for that. I should have... Oh, crap. I should have brought that lever action I have with me. Man the hall! Something's out there! Can you... Excuse me. Excuse you me. You sure you saw something? This ain't a drill! What the heck are... It's not death claws, right? I killed everyone. The gate. Open the gate. I've got wounded out here. Mariner, there's no time. Look to the fog. They're coming. Gulpers. Oh god. Defend yourself. The hecker gulpers. Fire at will. Who's there? Can't see. Try to keep these people alive. Holy crap. Oh. Mess with me. Are you oh dude, those wounded people it's died over. really no. quick. Eyes on the fog. Something's coming. I Are they throwing grenades? What the heck? Are they throwing grenades? You know what? I'm gonna just go down here. I could take them better myself. Let's pull out overseers. Come on out of cover. Is that it? Oh, I'm so sorry. All right. Well done, all. Open the gate. Dude, y'all got wrecked. Appreciate the help, Mainlander. We're all still. Yeah, sorry to cut you off there. I'm just trying to. Where's that legendary go? That's a young. Oh, that's not bad actually not bad okay let's go back inside the town need general supplies visit the bait shop we'll dig in and hold this position you're one of them vault people with the funny suits how'd you guess maybe the whole vault tech paint on Avery. everything and now you see what we're up against the fog and the creatures it spits out have taken the whole island from my people but for your help when we needed it you deserve this oh nice You've lost the whole island? Oh, it's an island. The fog's okay. been here forever. There are good years when it recedes and the island's almost normal. Then there are times when it spreads all over. And people have to cling to any patch of land free of the fog. For the past, oh, eight years or so, it's been getting as bad as it's ever been. Now, Far Harbor's one of the only places left that's safe. What's... The fog. Where to begin? The fog's radioactive, right? But there are pockets of it, the deep fog, that are hard fallout. And as deadly as that is, that's only part of the problem. Things live in the fog, thrive. You think what attacked the harbor's bad? Oh, there's far worse further inland. Really? Okay. If you managed to survive despite all that, you must be tough. <laughs> Ornery, more like. I just... I'm done cowering behind your damn hull, Avery. Time you let me deal with the real problem. With the right people and my guns, I can end those children of Adam cultists for good. The fog's been here forever. The children didn't make it. Before the Rat Eaters came, the fog was under control. They come, and it all goes wrong. It's time we do something. No need to burden the stranger with all this nonsense. Can we get back to business? Sorry for all that. You're here for Kasumi, right? She headed inland to the Synth Refuge, Acadia. Getting there will be dangerous. You'll need a guide. 
old Longfellow. No one knows the fog like him. But a uh, word of warning, he's a bit of an acquired taste. Thanks for the info. Best place to look for Longfellow's at the bar. The last plank. And, uh, please, lend a hand around town if you're able. Even if it's slapped away, people like the Mariner and Cassie and others need help. And let me say something you might not hear again. Thank you. Appreciate it. Catch you off guard. Buy my guns. Mariner. The hull took a battering, to be sure. But she wouldn't be standing at all if it weren't for you. They call me the Mariner, shipwright, handyman. The town's lucky you're here. You blow. I don't suppose. And they won't be. Uh -huh. Sign me up. Eagles sure. Cove Tannery. Uh huh. Okay, so it's just places I need to go. Alan. Huh. The mainlander. Great. Fire your gun a few times and you think you're something. Sure. Hey, buddy. Charity makes you. What happens next time? Either us harm. So if you're here to buy some or. Mm hmm. Show me what you got. You got it. Oh, nice. Jeez. Curved Ripper. You guys have uh, lever actions, and this this is the DLC that introduced them, I believe. Yeah, okay. I don't have any 4570 ammo. I can no, that's not what I that's not no, I meant uh scoped lever action rifle. What's uh you don't have any oh, okay, up above. Ooh, two thousand. Jeez. I'm gonna pay that much? For what? Oh, most of the cost is the ammo. Okay. Well, let me grab it again. I probably got some stuff I could sell to you. Like, I have some Deathclaw steaks. Yeah, honestly, that's 650 caps right there. And I have the Myrlurk Queen meat. Holy crap. I forgot I have 20 of those. Let me just sell you like 10. And I have some alcohol. Somewhere here. <laughs> Synthetic gorilla meat. I'm not going to use any more robot companions, I don't think, so I could just sell all those. That works out perfectly. Okay. Nice. Can I make any upgrades? Food. Stim packs. Fully stocked. I can afford it, but I put in all my gear over to uh, my workshop and sanctuary, so I guess I'm kind of stuck with what I got for now. I'll do my best to upgrade it between episodes. Maybe I'll go back, end up fast traveling back to sanctuary or something so I can go help them out. So, who's Cassie? Are you Cassie? You're that mainlander who just got here. Better watch you. I should know. Sounds interesting. I thought you... My family. Mm -hmm. It was lumber and fishing. The islands. Uh -huh. Ah. With the strangers. I'm just gonna skip through this. Let me guess. I'm... Ah. Now, on to Petey was my... He was out... Oh, anyway, you're a talker. Of course. Those feral... Those ghouls are as good as dead. Good. Okay, I can do that. 
So, where is these, uh, let me activate them. Hall Breach, Feral Ghouls. That's the tannery for the power tools. National Park Campground for that. Beaver Creek Lanes. Hey, that's the, uh... Clear out Beaver Creek Lanes. That's the cleansing the Commonwealth quest. I'll do the uh, old Longfellow first, I guess. The last plank. Trying to have a conversation here. Shut your mouths, open your damned ears. So the fogs are coming for us all, and I can't see any better way of greeting it than to have another round. On the house! Yeah! Woo! Time to party! Here's some Mitch! Mitch! Mainlander, today's your lucky day. Free beer for ya! <laughs> you have anything a bit stronger? Pushing your luck, are ya? Ha! I like it. Take this. Top shelf all around. So, drink up! You stay here over... Uh-huh. I'd like to run a room. It's up the stairs. Yeah, why not? Mitch. Ten caps. Booze for the belly or bunk for the night? I'd like a drink. Music... Okay, so upstairs. Hey, why not? See what happens. Sleep for four hours. Oh, nice. I haven't gotten that I once. I, for of... one, won't go down unless I'm roaring drunk. <laughs> okay, old Longfellow. Oh. There we go. You've unlocked point of interest map markers across the island. Not enough. What does that mean? So, Cliff's Edge Hotel, Eden Meadows Cinemas, Oceanarium, Echo Lake Lumber, Rayburn Point, Southwest Harbor, Old Pond House. Well, that's a settlement. Cranberry Island Bog. Brooks Head Lighthouse, MS Azalea, and I believe that's it. Oh, so you could just fast travel back to the Commonwealth. Okay, that makes Folks value a lot of help. Sharp okay, old Longfellow. Captain Avery said you can get me to Acadia. Heard there was a scuffle out there. You get. Your, I'm done leading people. Last fella couldn't keep up. Didn't last five minutes. Can you tell me about Acadia? Strange folk like there. Call themselves. Seems to me they just, uh -huh. they've done some good turns. Wouldn't even be a far harbor left without those. Oh, so they made the... What's a fog condenser? The condensers? They're a tricky bit of science. They keep the fog away. Powered by the wind farm, the synth fellas got up and running. Us islanders don't particularly like people. Right. Some parents are worried about their runaway daughter. She went to Acadia, and I need to find her. If someone's headed for Acadia, there's always a story. Yours worth dying over, huh? Yeah. I've done a whole lot more for a whole lot less. Clever with words, are you? I can get you to Acadia. Still won't be easy. Then the real work can Uh huh. Should I make any other preparations? Ammo, stim packs. I need okay. to take care of a few things. Handle your nest. Right. You don't like the service, there's the door. Oh, shut up. 
Okay, well, I'm not going to head over there right yet. I'm going to look around the town real quick. And this will probably where we be where we end this part for now. And the next part, we'll head up to Acadia with Old Longfellow. But, well, if it loads, I want to see around the town real quick before I head out. See if there's anything else that needs to be done. There we go. Is there anything else around here? Hard times. Arbor Man. My legs got nothing on the fog. Don't say I didn't warn you. Old Longfellow knows what he's about. Hmm. No one talks to my brother, all right? Hi there. Hmm. Hey, you, Bertha. You still here for some reason? Well, I'm mean, not to talk, to talk to you, to obviously. Bertha. She's crazy. Take it one day at a time. What are you looking at? Hey. Damn those feral ghouls. And damn the island for sending them after Petey. You need it? The bait shop's got it. It's funny, I have like seven... Whatever. Okay. I have like... Food in front, dock in back. The bait shop. Oh, okay. I have some seven or something. Uh, mainlander like you stands no chance. God, everybody keeps on interrupting me. I got like seven. I, I don't even remember what I was gonna say. I think the Myrler Queen Meat. You ain't long for this world. Is this place a, uh, oh, a workshop? Because that's the power armor stand. But you been to the tannery? You find my tools yet? No, I have not done that yet. Thank you. Because this feels like it's going to be a workshop. Like, it really does. But I haven't seen a red station yet. Oh, wow. Fresh shipment. All your medical Is that an alive Meyer Lurk? I don't think so. Okay. Need to drown your troubles? Dr. Mitch, the last plank. Okay, well, I think this is where we're going to end this part. Next time, we'll actually take off um, heading to Acadia with Old Longfellow. I don't know where it's actually at. I really don't. I hope it's not an insanely long walk. But we'll find out. It's probably close to the middle of the island. So, they got a nice little town set up here. Even though these uh, creatures attack every once in a while. But it's pretty sick. They got a nice uh, setup. So, I'm impressed. Bait shop's got everything okay, you need. Okay, like I said, this is where we're going to end it for now. I'll see y'all next time with the second part of this Far Harbor DLC. Love see y'all next time. Take care. Hand.